We are under the lights as the show gets you ready for another edition of Major League Baseball. A good matchup here for you tonight between the Arizona Diamondbacks and the San Francisco Giants. So striding forward now, Starling Marte. He'll get us started in this one under the lights. The 1-1 one, one home. Two, one. Hit back up. And oh, this is off the second base bag. And the throw will be too late at first, so a strange play there as it'll wind up with an infield single. At the plate now, Nick Ahmed. Now a change of locks him up as he looks at strike three called one away. Ready now for the Diamondbacks. Cattel Marte. First swings for him in this one with a runner still at first and one gone. Ah, changed things up on him and he got him to swing through it. One and two now. Throw over to first and the runner back. One two pitch. Marte leads off first with one away. Hit on the ground out to short. There is Crawford. The second for one. We laid a belt. They get two, and that'll end the inning. At the plate, Wilmer Flores. It lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. The 1-1 one, one home. Hit softly on the ground to third. And a good throw gets him one gone. So one away here with the bases empty. And stepping in the slip field and shortstop Brandon Crawford. 1-1. One, one. Great knuckle curve just buckled him there, and there are two gone. So bases are empty here with two gone, and that brings in the outfielder Hunter Pence. One and two now as that one's fouled off. Coming down in buckets, cats and dogs, insert metaphor here, and the forecast is not showing any signs of relief. Total agreement, Matt, in particular that pitcher's mound. You know, one of the things you have to really be careful and we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three and that will retire the side. So here's the cleanup hitter for Arizona, David Peralta. He's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest. Lifted the other way out to left center. Heading after it is Dickerson. He's there and records the first out. Eduardo Escobar standing in. First at bat for him in this one. He was one for four with a double in the ball game last night. One and two, here it comes. Popped him up. Under it is Sandoval, and there's the second out. Striding in, Christian Walker. And he's definitely off to a fast start in the early part of the season. And a change up here, but that's taken low in the dirt for a ball. Yeah, the rain starting to intensify here. It's coming down a little heavier now. We'll see how much longer the umpires can wait. Well, you could say that again, Matt. It's raining cats and dogs out there. Make sure you don't step in a poodle. I think it's time to get the grounds crew out. That is tough. The catcher, Stephen Vogt. Standing in now, Stephen Vogt. No. Nearly got the inside, but ruled the ball. No reason to sit on anything other than the hard stuff in a location you like and drive it right now. Throw on to first gets him and the side is retired. Now 
the Giants number four batter Mike Yastrzemski and he's definitely off to a fast start in the early part of the season. Hit sharply on the ground. A diving effort here as he gets a glove on it. And a good try to recover that time but he'll beat it out as he's aboard to kick off the That's inning. Good. The third base at the plate, Pablo Sandoval. And this is low, ball two, two and one. Nope. And it misses, three and one now. I love the approach out on the mound. Everything's down in the zone as it should be, but now you find yourself in a three one count. Do you elevate a little bit more and get back in this zone? And Sandoval's aboard, a base hit. Into the box now, Alex Dickerson. And the knuckle curved that time. Got him swinging, and that's the first out. So in now for San Francisco, Brandon Belt, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Ground ball to second. This could be two. There's one. On to first as they get the double play to get him out of the inning. Standing in, Ildemaro Vargas. And he's looking to get it going. Off to a bit of a slow start this year. The 1 2. Swing and a ball lifted in the air toward the line and right. And this will be handled by Pence for the first out. Coming to the plate now, the pitcher for the Diamondbacks, Zach Gallen. He'll get to take his first cuts here. And a ball and two strikes to the Diamondbacks pitcher. Grounded to first. Fielded cleanly by Belt, and he'll step on first for the out. Three unassisted. Now back. Here's Starling Marte. Starling Marte. Now the three and two pitch. And this is taken low for ball four, and they'll have themselves a two out base runner here after all. Now batting. Up next for Arizona, Nick Ahmed. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Ground ball. Oh, and that's off the second base bag. Crawford's got it, and they won't get an out from this as he's able to reach on a play that you just don't see very often. In now, Patel Marte. And that's low ball four. Digging in for his second at bat, David Peralta. One of the bigger spots in the ball game so far. Base is juiced now with two away. The set and the 1 1 into center field line drive base hit one run scores and the second run will score as well the third base number five Eduardo stepping in now Eduardo Escobar in there one and two now well below the knees laid off on the change up there this inning hasn't gone the way he wanted it to, but it's not a total disaster yet. Sometimes pitching is about damage. He pulls this one high and deep to right center field. Out of here to the deepest part of the yard. To the plate now, Christian Walker. In for strike two. Oh, don't know how you lay off that one, but he did, and it's two and two. Boy, his pitch count has really spiked here in this inning. He threw it right past him, a swing and a miss at the gas, and that ends the inning. Next to bat for the Giants, Buster Posey. And his guys have quite a hill to climb, down five zip here in the early going. 
Lots of baseball left in this one as we're still early on, but you don't want to fall too far behind. They're already down by a bundle, and one of the things you want your leadoff guy to get on and set the table for the big boys to start driving in some runs. Now a swing and a miss as he picks up another one. Make it four strikeouts already, and there's your first out. The one one home. On the ground to the left side. Throw on to first, two gone. Now with the plate, Wilmer Flores. Second at bat now. He grounded out to start home first. Slow roller out to short. He's got it. Throw in time, and the side is retired. All set for the start of the fourth. So striding in, Stephen Vogt. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Even though they're up by a boatload early on in this one, you can't get complacent and get lazy. They got to keep the gas pedal down because this team that they're playing can strike and score a lot of runs too. Three and two now. Hit softly down the line at first. But this will get foul, so they'll do it again. Three and two. And this is swung on and missed in this fourth inning. We'll start the same way he ended the third the with bat. a strikeout. And there's the one away. Bill tomorrow. Here we go. Here's the one and one delivery. Now a fastball is lifted into the air to shallow center. In there, a base hit. The throw into second. The tag, and he is out at second. Standing in now, Zach Gallen. Had nibbled the corner there, but missed two and one. To two and two now. Five runs, six hits. No errors so far for the Diamondbacks. Weak grounder down the line at third. But a foul ball as it holds it two and two. And the pitch. He chases out of the zone for strike three, and that's the third out of the inning. Brandon Crawford digging in next. He's 0 for 1 thus far. From the windup, the 1-1 one -one pitch. Hit down the third baseline. But this will get foul. It's a ball and two strikes. And it'll lay off the curveball that's in the dirt that time, and it's back to even now at two and two. Well below the knees laid off on the changeup there. Not a time to fool around right now on a 3-2 count with the middle part of the order coming up. Expect a good pitch to swing at. And it's fouled away. Payoff pitch one more time. And another foul ball. And he turns on this one and yanks it foul and back out of play. No walks yet. Here's the delivery. And they'll finally just wear him down as this one swung on and missed for the first out. Here's the right fielder Hunter Pence comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Now a fastball swung on and missed and it's full 3 and 2. When you get yourself to a 3-1 count and you get a fastball, those are the ones you really want to punish. Couldn't get the bat on it, so we'll see if that comes back to haunt Next will be the cleanup hitter, Mike Yastrzemski. And a fastball blew it right by him, and there are two down. 
at the plate. Pablo Sandoval as the switch hitter will take his cuts left handed here. It's very difficult being a switch hitter and very rarely do you see the same hitter from both. A swing and a miss that retires the side and that will do it. Digging in next will be Starling Marte. The 2-1 home. Right side. Oh, look at the stop by Bell. He's up with it. The throw. And the first out of the inning is a beautiful one. What a play. Stepping into the box, Nick Ahmed. He's one for two in the ball game. Now the payoff pitch home. Line drive to left. He lays out for it, but he can't pull it in. And he'll pull into second with one away. Sam Coonrod, a six foot two inch right hander, jogs in to take over on the mound. Martel, your attention, please. Now pitching for the Giants. Number 65. At the plate now, Patel Marte, high in the air and drifting out to shallow center. In comes Dickerson. He gets there, and that's the second out. And no tag at second. He'll head back there with two away now. So here's the cleanup hitter, David Peralta. A couple of RBIs for him already and a chance for more here. Now the one and one pitch. This one's smoked the other way. High and deep to left. Back goes Yastrzemski. But he can't get to this one. It's off the wall. The third base Eduardo. at the plate Eduardo Escobar line drive to center field and he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away and that ends the inning stepping in Alex Dickerson looking to put the ball in play here he went down on strikes in his first at bat yeah he's got to put that one behind him especially with runners in scoring position those punch outs will stick with you a little longer and he goes and chops this one out towards second and there's one away here's the first baseman Brandon Bell surprisingly here this is on the ground to the right side and he'll take it to the bag himself for the out so bases are empty here with two gone and that'll bring up the former World Series champ MVP and rookie of the year Buster Posey this is skied into short left center Peralta on the move he tracks it down and that will end the inning Ready for another shot now, Christian Walker. He was sat down on strikes in his last at bat. Yeah, and kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. You could tell he was late on that one. And we'll see if he tries to cheat to something this AB. Throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. Now back. Ready for another chance? Mm -hmm. Steven Vogt, 0 for 2 Vogt. for him to this point. Now the one and one pitch. Hey. This is swung out and missed, so it's two up, two down to start the sixth inning. The batter number Ready three. now, Hildemaro Vargas. He was thrown out Hildemaro. at second trying to stretch a base hit into a double in his last at bat. Yeah, Matty, his wheels got him in trouble a little bit last time. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end the inning. Donovan Solano is going to come off the bench as he'll be asked to lead off the bottom of inning number six. Now a curveball here, nowhere close. That's in the dirt. It's three and one. One thing that could nag at you as a pitcher is having to work really hard to get a guy that you think you should be able to cruise right through. He's not known for his offensive prowess, but he's putting together a real nice at bat here. Wilbur. 
No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. All you want is the leadoff man to get on to start a big inning. Maybe get a big rally going to claw your way back into this ball game. Fouled away. And he struck him out. Strikeout number eight now in the ball game for him. So digging in now, Brandon Crawford. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Now the one and one pitch. And he fouls this one off. No runs, two hits, and no errors on the giant ledger to this point. Had to sit back on the changeup, and he did a good job to get the bat on that one. Count still at one and two. All right, Brandon. Got him. And that's the third time we've written a K next to his name in this one. The right fielder, number eight. Digging in, Hunter, Hunter Pence. It was a walk in his last trip. Now the one and one pitch is looked at for ball number two. Ran one in there as this is hit on the ground towards second. Reined in. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Danny Jimenez comes on to pitch now, hoping for better results than the other arms that they've run out there in this one. Seventh inning ready to roll. Coming to the plate now, Zach Gallen. He went down on strikes last time up. Yeah, Maddie, big time K last time up, and it's been a tough series for him so far. You can tell he's just not seeing the ball off this team. Let's see if he can make an adjustment right here. One gun down the Arizona seventh, and that'll bring up Starling Marte. Here's the one and one pitch. Count is two and one. Grounder down the line at third. But this will be a foul ball as that evens things at two and two. Hit in the air out to center field. Dickerson's under it, and that's the second out of the inning. Digging in and looking for more. Nick Ahmed, two for three with a double on his line so far. Now the two one pitch. I got three one. Three ball. One strike. Line to the right side. And that'll get down for a two out single. The center field so field now field. to the plate, Cattell Marte. A good action Marte. on the two seamer there, and it's one and two. Fouled off. A runner on first with two away. In the dirt here, but it won't skip away far enough for the runner to advance. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Yastrzemski's got it for out number three. We join for the traditional seventh inning stretch. Stepping in, Mike Yastrzemski. He's singled in two trips to the plate thus far. It doesn't look very promising so far in this one as we move into the later innings. Down by a bundle, it's time to get some base runners and hopefully a long ball to get them back into this one. To two and two now. <laughs> Trying to nibble here and he misses to run it full now. Three and two. There's the Panda on deck. He'll bat next. And he connects with it. This one's hit deep out to left center field. And he's going to have room to put this one away. And that's the first out. Digging in to try it again. Pablo Sandoval. One for two on his line so far in the game. The 1-1. One out. Nobody on. Nobody on. 
to two balls and two strikes now. And good patience to hold back on the curveball in the dirt. It's full now, three and two. Pretty easy pitch to lay off there, two and two. Not even close to being in the strike zone. He made it easy for the hitter in that one. And that'll bring up the big bat of Alex Dickerson. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. The 1-1. One, one. Now a shot out toward the alley in right center. This will kick up against the wall now. Sandoval rounds the corner and is headed home. He will score. And they're on the board. It's 6-1. to one. Merrill Kelly takes the call from the pen as he'll try to get the final two outs of this seventh frame. In now, Brandon Belt. Full count now. Here's the payoff pitch. Line drive, base hit to right. The runner from third comes across to score as they try and chip away at the deficit. Into the box, Buster Posey. Out of play. Payoff pitch one more time. And he swings and pops it foul behind the plate. And a fairly easy play there as he'll back up a step to put this away for the second out. Mauricio Dubon will look for some two out magic here as he'll pinch it with two gone and a runner at first. Two out with the man at first. But this won't get over the second baseman's glove as he's got it to end the inning. John Del Gustave has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Number 74. Trying to pick things up where he left off. David Peralta. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Well, he got a good pitch to hit last time up. Looked for it up in the zone and didn't miss it. Those are the pitches you only get maybe once an AB, maybe once a game, maybe once a week. So he certainly capitalized on it last time. Here now the 2 2. Chopped on the ground over to first. But this is going to be a foul ball as that keeps things at two and two. And that's low, so a good eye there as he works the count back full. And just when you needed a shutdown inning, a leadoff walk was certainly not on the agenda. He needs a bear down right here. And a good take there will nut him a base runner as it's ball four now to start the eighth inning. The runner at first with no outs here. Back up the middle. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. So following the error, it's now runners at first and second. And here comes the first baseman, Christian Walker. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. Swing, and there it goes. Deep to left field. Into the bleachers, and gone. Sean Anderson enters now in a mop-up role as he'll try to keep the deficit right where it is. Number 64, Sean Anderson. Standing in now, Stephen Vogt. This one's down to third. Sandoval has it. Throw to first is in time for the first down. Riding in once again, Ildemaro Vargas. He was a ground-out victim last time up. Can't keep the weight back, and he falls behind one and two. And it's fouled away. Three runs already home here. And he lays off it to even the count two and two. Well, two straight fastballs inside haven't put him away, so now it'll be interesting to see what he turns to. 
and he'll whip this one over to first, and he gets his man for the second out. Domingo Leyva will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. Number one, Domingo Leyva. And he gets around on one and hits it high and deep to straightaway right. And he's going to make the catch. And he paid a big price for it, too, as he crashes headlong into the wall. Stefan Crichton is on to pitch out of the bullpen in the bottom half of the eighth. Number 58. Stefan. So the batting order turns over now and set to go. Wilmer Flores. He got called out on strikes his last time through. And Matty, it was a pretty nasty breaking ball that buckled this guy. That has to be in the back of his mind as he walks to the plate right here. Has to protect against looking foolish again on the off speed. Sometimes it can be difficult for a pitcher. You're facing a guy that's not known to be a big stick in the lineup. Sometimes the toughest thing is to be aggressive and throw strikes. Throw on to first in time, one away. Stepping into the box, Brandon Crawford. Lifetime in this matchup. He's hitless in three at bats. One one home now to Crawford. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Sent on the ground out to second. In time to first, and there are two away. Coming to the plate now, Hunter Pence. Only four outs remaining for them to try and rally back in this one. The one two. Two out, nobody on. Line to the right side. And that's going to be a base hit for Pence. Now batting. No one field. Into the box now. Mike Yastremski. Fastball right back to the mound. And he'll flip it onto first, and with it, that ends the inning. Tyler Rogers comes on to pitch now, hoping for better results than the other arms that they've run out there in this one. Back to the top spot in the Arizona lineup now and stepping in, Starling Marte. He's working on a one for three thus far. Now the one and one pitch. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. And this one bounds around against the wall. And he'll get there as the Diamondbacks get a man into scoring position on the leadoff the double. Bat, number 13, shortstop, Nick Ahmed. And he comes back with a gorgeous slider there for strike two. Hit to third. There's Sandoval. And that's the first out. Digging in, Cattell Marte. He's hitless in three at-bats to this point. Ball two with a sinker that runs off the inside. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Dickerson's under it. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. Now at the plate, David Peralta. So far, two for three in this one. David Peralta. Just a bit high with the fastball, but didn't get the call. Looking at his lifetime numbers, Peralta brings in a batting average right at 290, a respectable number for sure. Grounded back up the middle, and this gets right through him, and that may be a run. They're going to extend their lead as the runner scores from second. The third baseman, Eduardo. Stepping in now, Eduardo Escobar. 
and he takes a cold strike two. Two strikes. Now a line drive caught at third by Sandoval. Pretty much right in the glove that time, and the inning is over. Here's the Panda now, Pablo Sandoval. One for two in the ball game thus far. The one and two pitch. There's a swing and a high deep drive headed for the right field corner. Into the cove, but foul. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Marte is under it. One out. So stepping in, Alex Dickerson. Tripled homer run last time through, so we'll see what he's got in store here. Popped him up. Escobar over to his left. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. Giants down to their final out now. And standing in now, the left-handed hitting first baseman, Brandon Belt. Ready with the one and one. Yanked high and deep down the line in right. And that is off the wall, but in foul territory. Foul ball. Last strike here for the Giants. Now a swing and a ground ball. This should do it. On to first, and that is going to conclude the festivities here tonight. It seemed like everyone had a hand in this win, and that's usually the case when you win a game by eight runs. Feels good to dominate a game like that. Ten to two, the final in this game. Arizona led this game from the third inning on and never wavered. Zach Gallen earns his first win of the season. Johnny Cueto permitted six earned runs to come across in the losing effort. So that's a wrap here tonight. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and Heidi Watney, this is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, find us on Twitter, at MLB The Show. Final line score for the ball game tonight. First for the victorious Diamondbacks, 10 runs, 12 hits, no errors. They left five men on base. For the Giants, two runs on five hits, one error. They left six men on base. Time of the ball game: three hours and 24 minutes. Thank you for joining us here this evening. We remind you to please. Drive home safely.